The delta-delta CT method is a widely used approach to calculate the relative gene expression from quantitative real-time PCR data. Here are the general steps to follow. Measure the cycle threshold CT values of the gene of interest and a reference gene in each sample. The reference gene should be stably expressed across all samples and should have a similar amplification efficiency as the gene of interest. Calculate the delta CT values for each sample by subtracting the CT value of the reference gene from the CT value of the gene of interest. This normalizes the expression of the gene of interest to the expression of the RG in each sample. Calculate the delta-delta CT values by subtracting the delta CT value of a control sample, for example a calibrator sample or a reference sample, from the delta CT value of each test sample. This provides a measure of the change in expression of the gene of interest relative to the control sample. Calculate the full change in gene expression using the formula, 2 delta delta CT. This represents the relative expression of the gene of interest in the test sample compared to the control sample. Note that the delta delta CT method assumes that the amplification efficiencies of the gene of interest and reference gene are approximately equal and that the reference gene expression is stable across all samples. It is important to carefully select the appropriate reference gene and to validate its stability before using this method.